back to my channel Dirty Things and I'm Dirty with you and first of all I'm so sorry about the fact that I'm uploading so so late but trust me today's video is going to be worth it and second if you are wondering that why I am not in my usual setup actually my room's AC isn't working so I had to make this video in my living room and today's video is going to be about the Naika haul that I bought for Durga Pujo as a Bengali Durga Pujo it's a big big festival for us and this is actually the most grand time of the year for us so let's get into the video now. So at first we got three products from Mars, a brush, an eyeshadow palette and one eyeliner. So the first product in today's haul is going to be one of my favorites from this haul is uh, the Mars 4-in-1 travel brush. So this is how the brush looks like and it is really really soft like this one is for the foundation and this is for the loose powder and there are two more here let me show you. This is like an eyeshadow brush or you can say it is a multi-purpose brush and uh, this is another tip. This is going to make my makeup easier and I would definitely suggest you to get one of these. I won't say that it is super affordable but at the same time it is totally worth it. So please uh, you can get one of these and this is going to help you out so much. I'm going to show you the application of these brushes uh, at the end of the video so please watch till end. And the next product is going to be Mars Back to Basics eyeshadow palette. I also wanted to get one of these for a long time. It had all the perfect nude shades along with the shimmery shades and just look at that palette. Like I have already started using this actually uh, but I am going to show you guys and these shades are really so pretty you can see the nose here all the festive colors are present here and this is going to be one of the ultimate festive palettes and now let me just show you the eyeshadow swatches this comes with this little applicator which is basically useless to me but I am still going to like try to swatch with this and I don't know if you guys can see it. Oh, <laughs> just look at that. Never mind. I just told you that these are really, really pigmented, and let me do the rest. So these are all the shades that are available in the palette. I don't know if you guys can see these shades but these are actually really pretty when applied on eyes. So no need to worry about that. Next is another product from Mars which is uh, the Tattoo Ink Eyeliner. I have been wanting to try this product for a long time. So I finally got this. And also I have tried so many sketch eyeliners before and the tip gets bad after some uses. So let's see how this one works. So this is how the tip looks like. I don't know if you guys can see it. Uh, let me give you a clear view like that. The tip is pretty good, not gonna lie. And now let's just swatch it. It is actually really easy application, you know, like just look at these thin lines. And if I talk about the packaging, it just looks so luxurious like look at this this is little stone and i don't know mars how are you providing so good quality with such an affordable price and this is going to be another must have from me if you like to use sketch eyeliners so these are all the products that i got from mars and this is such an affordable brand i just love their quality their products looks really really good and now let's just move on to the next one which is going to be nika so the first thing I got from Nika Cosmetics is this all day matte powder and I have actually opened it up because I am using it currently and uh, this is how the packaging looks like this is the outer packaging and this is how it looks like from the inside it actually comes with a puff but I have removed it and this is how the powder looks like and just let me show you the coverage I have taken a generous amount I mean, are you guys seeing the difference? Just look at the powders coverage alone. 
I don't know what will happen if you apply it over a foundation, but just look at that coverage of the powder alone. If you guys looking for a good compact powder, then you should definitely go for this one. Next up, we have Nykaa Skin Shield Foundation, and uh, trust me, there is a whole lot of drama with this foundation. And this is how the packaging looks like. And back then, when Nykaa Hot Pink Sale was going on, I bought some products and I got a free sample of this Skin Shield Foundation uh, with one of my orders. And this is in the shade Hot Honey 07. I mean, look at that. And uh, this is how the mini looked like and when I tried the mini, I really really liked the foundation's uh, formula and the color was a perfect match for me. As you guys can see, I have actually used a lot of this mini product. It was blending so easily, like just look at that and it was like a perfect shade match for me. So I decided to buy this full size product. And unfortunately, like this is in the shade Hot Honey 07. I can also show you on the packaging, like look at that Hot Honey 07. And when I actually got this foundation in my hand, let me just show you what happened. These are totally different shades. I actually bought the full size product on the basis of the mini and I was literally so disappointed at first because it came like this and when I reached out to Nykaa's customer service via email they said that I have already opened the packaging so there is nothing they can do I was really upset and I actually decided to make an Instagram post and I did it and after that they texted me on Instagram that they are going to resolve my issue after a lot of back and forth they decided to give me a refund and I accepted it because why not it was my money right so apart from the tester and full size problem, the foundation itself is really good. It is really good formula. With the help of the AI try-on, you can definitely go for a suitable shade for you guys because this foundation is really good and it blends so easily and gives you a very natural yet good uh, makeup base. Next up, we got two products from Inside Cosmetics. First one is going to be their concealer palette. And I have been wanted to trying a concealer palette from a long time because uh, this one has color corrector and I have already used it as you guys can see it's really creamy they are really blendable and they are also really good cut color correctors it also has some light shades and some dark shades so you can also do your contour with this this is how the swatch looks like I mean, yeah, they are pretty good color correctors and color correcting is a really important part of makeup. And according to his prides, it performs pretty well, not gonna lie. So if you are looking for a good uh, color corrector palette, then you can go for this one. Next and the last item from today's haul is going to be Inside Cosmetics Blush. And let me just open it up for you guys. This is in the shade 02 Raspberry Gelato. And uh, this is how it looks like. This is a really pretty pink shade and uh, let's just swatch it. I mean, just look at that. The formula is really, really creamy. Look at that pretty pink shade. It is really, really pigmented. Now let's just apply it on my face with the help of the Mars brush. And I'm using the side. Just look at that and... I feel like I have taken a lot of product. Just look at that. How pretty is that, right? I really, really like the pink color. And it leaves a really pretty glow. So that will be it for today's video. Let me know about your thoughts in the comments. And uh, don't forget to follow me on my Instagram where I post daily content. And if you like my content, please consider subscribing and liking my videos. So bye. See you in the next video.